What does tax time and COVID-19 mean? Scanning in documents, of course. And I've always done this by leaning a tripod over a table, which works, but it's a bit iffy. So this year, I'm finally gonna build a camera stand for doing this better. I'm gonna use this scrap of particle board as my base, and the camera has to go above here like so. So if I just laid it out flat like this, uh, imagine the uh, paper was actually right here, then I need an angled support that goes from the base up to the camera, roughly like so. I'm just gonna glue an extra piece of wood on the bottom just to give it more support. So I only glued this 10 minutes ago, but uh, sometimes the glue sets up pretty fast. So I'm just gonna take the clamps off and start working on this. With the camera centered above the paper, which would be here, uh, I want this on here like so, to bring it over to the camera, a little bit over because I'll cut that off a little bit. And then I'm gonna cut a little bit off the back here, just to have more hold for the screws. And then this needs to be cut like so. I just gotta check that it comes out vertical. Minor adjustment. This shallow indentation is so that the camera pushes against this part further from the hole and that prevents the camera from twisting like that too much. Looking through my thread knobs drawer, I actually found one that's perfect for the job with a quarter inch thread. Except I had to uh, cut off a little bit around here for it to fit. And then I cut that too deeply, so now I need to use it with a washer. So that holds the camera in about the right place, but before I attach it to the base, I'm going to make that post a little skinnier because it casts a bit of a shadow. This came out nice enough that I decided to varnish it and I'm just gonna dry it in front of the infrared heater for about 10 minutes before I put on the second coat. I've put on the second coat and I've got two heaters on it and uh, 45 minutes after I put on the first coat, my second coat is uh, completely dry. I love infrared heaters. Of course, I do have a scanner on my printer, but I find using a dedicated scanner is way too slow.